Hello everyone. So today I want to showcase that I have completed UI parts for the these shoes. Uh, well, not shoes exactly, leg gummers, and also for the gauntlets as well. But right now I only have one gauntlet type, so only this appears there, and the rest is already working. You can see we can change the headgear and the changes appear here so yeah that's I just wanted to let you guys know that I have done those changes and I didn't want to cover them in a tutorial because I have already shown how each of those uh, items are implemented in the heart in the uh, inventory system uh, in the menu system so all we have is let me show you just quickly go through in the inventory man you can see this is assigned to the gauntlet and this is this button is assigned to the leg commerce and for the gauntlet i have found the event here actually you don't have to do that do it this way you can just you could just select the button and add on dispatch as well and that's what i have done for the leg gamma button here so basically i get a reference to the hud and switch to item inventory i call this function with leg gamma as the input and then well if you refer to previous tutorials you can see how each of these uh, functions are implemented let me quickly show you what happens there as well here is the switch to item inventory and for the leg armor it goes this way use the left hand weapons widget and switch widget then I focus on widget by the way this is something new I added a new focus point as legs and I changed this left hand and right hand into left hand weapon and right hand weapon and then finally in the inventory I have added this right hand and also legs these two spring arms which i have used here when i want to say I change the focus point so that's how my character is focusing on legs when i choose legs and other than that in the player state i have added this leg gamma classes gauntlet classes additionally compared to what we had before and I am returning them here in this get weapon classes by type and also I have added them here gauntlet and leg armor to the add collectible class event as well all right so with that we have completed let me just show you uh, this armor this is done and also we already had swords it's also done and shield so done shoes done helmet's done okay so yeah uh, only remaining things are this actually i don't think i would need this this why i added this button because i was referring to as this great uh we need to have a range weapon so when i have the range weapon i will implement this and also i'm not sure what to do with it, this so maybe we would use something appropriate for this button as well okay and other than that i did a small change to speed up the transition here and the well, here in the apply weapon event here on button press and this apply weapon part here if it is server i wait 0.01 seconds delay if it is not the server i wait three seconds so this will return true even if the system is on a standalone mode so this delay this a uh, additional delay is there to make sure everything is replicated when we use the inventory in a multiplayer game but if you are not then we can quickly allow changing items so that's why i have this reduced number here so yeah that is something i additionally did 
okay so that's for watching as always updated project files will be available for download in the patron page link would be in the description below and once you become a member not just this project you can download anything that i have done in my channel to the day there are over 2000 videos for each video project files are available here and this is a part of this action rpg with gameplay ability system series you can watch all other episodes as well from my in my channel i'll leave the link to the full playlist in the description you can implement everything in from scratch by following these tutorials okay so don't forget to like and subscribe let me know if you have any questions in the comments and see you in another episode goodbye